Welcome back to CAD CAM tutorial. Today we are going to design a simple nut with knurling. See this is the knurling outside and internal thread. So this is simple and very interesting nut. I hope you like it. So let's see how to do in SOLIDWORKS. So let's start. Choose front plane sketch. Now here we will draw the body for nut. Let's choose center line draw a vertical and a horizontal center line exit now select line and start from here draw a horizontal line vertical line and connect with this line exit now let's define this geometry define this overall length 11.5 mm the distance from this bottom line 8.75 mm select this top line 14.75 mm and this line 12.5 mm just delete this select this line and make relation horizontal now defined again 12.5 mm let's say this length 14 mm okay now define this this width 1.5 mm and define this length 6 mm now you can see it here the geometry is fully defined so ok and go to features and choose revolve boss base command and here axis of revolution we will select this horizontal axis see preview select ok now this is the body of nut let's choose fillet select this outer edge 1 mm now again choose chamfer select 0.5 mm select this edge ok now we will select one more time chamfer 1 mm select this inside edge and here also this edge ok now this is the body now select this face first we want to create a hair knurling face select this face a sketch first draw a center line vertical center line it must be passed through origin ok now let's select line and start to draw a triangle here exit now select this center line and this two outer lines make relation collinear. Now first define the angle. We prefer 60 mm, 60 degree and let's select this distance. Prefer 0 0.5 mm ok draw a center line exit now select this point and this point make relation merge drag this triangle down 
and we will define some distance between these two lines point 0.3 point 0.3 mm this is i think better deal okay now select here extruded cut and cut choose here through all okay now you can see we cut a small grooves now we want to make number of patterns select here select cut outs and choose here x path see here and uh, we want 150 number of faces pattern select okay now you can see here this looking very small so we will do some editing select sketch edit sketch normal here we will do some editing delete this cut out go to sketch now select this two points gap right point 0.3 point mm now simply exit now you can see we changed now this is your knurling surface is look better now we will make the thread inside this body inside thread so select this face normal sketch select circle and draw here a circle and let's make the diameter 26 mm okay go to feature and select curves choose helix and spiral now we want to create first path select pitch and revolution and number of pitch i prefer 1.25 mm and the obviously reverse direction seven number of revolution it's enough for our geometry zero angle start angle zero degree okay now we will choose the profile for thread so let's select top plane a sketch normal and here we will draw a thread profile just draw a triangle connect here from here to this midpoint exit select this line make construction geometry again select this line this three lines and make a relation symmetric now let's define this dimension first make the angle 60 degree okay now let's define the edge length of one edge i prefer 0.589 mm okay now select this sharp edge press shift key and select the path and we will create one relation piers now see the geometry is fully defined so simply exit from the sketch now it's time to create a thread so go to features and select a feature command swift cut see here we selected the profile just select here path see it's already calculated by solid works software how to cut the thread inside you can see the preview of cutting thread select okay that's it now see we made the thread cut out inside now it's time to define the material so just go to appearance edit appearance metal in metal you will find many kinds of materials uh, sometime i like this steel also but today i'll prefer chrome plate see it's like a real look real view so i hope you like like it please subscribe our channel for more video and more projects in solid works don't forget to share and like our videos if you have any comment please write
in comments box we, i will try to answer each and every questions thanks for watching